Hi little skeletons, it is Disney Queen Skelly here and welcome back to another Disney Media Review. So today we are reviewing Flowers and Trees, it's a silly symphony. So uh, the way that my reviews work is I read what is said on IMDb when I did my research before I actually ended up watching the short. I'll give you the ratings that IMDb gave them, I'll kind of read a brief summary or synopsis depending on what was given, and then I'll let you guys know how I felt about the short or movie and why I felt that way. So let's get started. Rating, 7.3 out of 10 stars, runtime 8 minutes. Summary 1. An evil tree stump, jealous of two trees in love, starts a forest fire. Summary 2. It's spring and the flowers, mushrooms, and trees do their calisthenics. Some trees play a tune using vines for harp strings and a chorus of robins. A nasty looking hollow tree does battle with a much healthier looking tree for the attention of a female tree and starts a fire in the process. Alright guys, so I gave this a 6.7 out of 10 skulls. Um, the only reason why is because it was good, it was cute, but it, again, wasn't exactly my favorite Silly Symphony that has been placed out there. I watched a little bit while Hubby was in the room with me. I was watching it in the kitchen, and he was like, Are you watching Flowers and Trees? I was like, Yeah. He goes, Oh my god, that was like one of my favorite Silly Symphonies. I was like, Hey, not mine. <laughs> So let me kind of give you some reasonings on why this wasn't exactly my favorite Silly Symphony. Um, so for one thing, the music was actually pretty. Um, it reminded me of Once Upon, Once Upon a Dream from Sleeping Beauty with how the melody went. And the flowers reminded me of the Alice in Wonderland flowers that like yawn and sing in Golden Afternoon, which is in fact my favorite Alice in Wonderland song. The tree stump reminds me of Oogie Boogie. <laughs> like the, <laughs> I don't know why. the tree stump just reminded me of Oogie Boogie. Uh, definitely some phallic symbols in the mushrooms, not gonna lie, I saw some very questionable symbols in those mushrooms. Flowers washing, f the, f the flowers washing their faces uh, kind of reminded me of the dwarves when they were washing up for supper in Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, I thought that was pretty cool. <laughs> it was a funny rejection, so the guy, the, the really pretty, you know, tree stump dude was like proposing to the, the tree stump girl and she was like, no, no, and she like continued dancing. <laughs> Uh, the tree stump also reminds me of like a predator, just given how he was kind of coming on to this other tree, and I was like, ooh, is that appropriate for children to watch? Mm hmm At one point during this battle between the two trees, the one tree stump, like the tree stump, the ugly one, falls on the floor, and there are these daisies that come trotting up on his chest, and he's just kind of like that holding the daisies. So I guess you could say he was pushing up daisies. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, an owl as a siren. So it's like once the forest fire started, an owl was used as like almost like a fire engine siren. It was really interesting. <laughs> the fire was sentient, which was interesting. It was like little like little flames. Like you know like when you draw flames, you kind of draw them individually sometimes if you're not a good artist like me. Well, these little fires were sentient. They started walking. It didn't really look like a forest fire too much to me. It just looked like, I mean like given kind of how it was, like there obviously wasn't like a 3D kind of pro projection thing where you could see depth. So to me the forest fire just kind of looked like it was random. But I mean hey, karma's a bitch. The stump got burnt. <laughs> Um, it was good symbolism with the vultures, like, that the stump got defeated and, you know, died. The vultures were going around him because, you know, he's dead and vultures prey on the dead and the weak. There was a tree wedding. It was cute. It wasn't one of my favorite silly symphonies. It was a nice watch. It was very interesting. Um, definitely one of the, I mean, it's, they're all unique in their own ways, the silly symphonies. And I mean, what I think about the movie, what I think about the silly symphony is obviously going to be different from what other people think about the silly symphony. So to me, it wasn't the best one, 6.7 out of 10. Uh, hopefully the next one that I review might be a little bit better. So I thank y'all so much for watching and let me know what you think of the silly symphony flowers and trees in the comment section down below. Bye little skeletons. Stay safe. I love you guys.